hey, we've got some Tongren points today for immunity and the respiratory system. So it's good for before you get sick, so you don't get sick. If you do get sick, it helps you recover. And when you do recover, it helps you get strong again. So let's get started first with cleaning out. I always like to clean out and clear the decks before we get started with the real stuff. So triple warmers 16 and 17 on the side of the neck. And triple warmer 20 at the top of the ear. So triple warmer 16 and 17. And 20. We're getting that cleaning crew up and at them. And we start with thoracic vertebrae. One, two, three, four, and seven. You know one, two, and three are really good for immunity. Uh, they're also on the back side of the lungs the upper lungs. In fact, all these points right here are on the back side of the lungs. So we're doing double duty with all of that. So one, two, three, four, and seven. We also put T6 in here, strongly connected to the diaphragm. You want your diaphragm supple. The more your diaphragm is able to work, the deeper breath you get, the better respiration, it has a knock-on effect that's so good for your body as a whole. And bladder nine on the back of the head. Bladder nine, right by the deep brain, the primal brain. Automatic control of circulation of all sorts, respiration and heartbeat also blood vessels, control of all these basic circulation processes, heart, lungs, and vessels. And bladder six up here, what a wonderful point. Front of the head at the top. Open your sinuses. Will help your breathing be better from this end. And right while we're here, Governing Vessel 22, oh, such a soothing point to the mind. I know these days there's a lot of worry and anxiety. This GV, Governing Vessel 22, is a really good go-to point for settling the mind, calming anxiety and fear. Okay, upper chest, kidney 27 and 26. We've got the front side of the upper lungs and a strong connection with T cells. T cells, as you know, a strong, strong part, foundation of the immune system. So lungs, airways, the bronchial tubes, all right here. Just put a, give them a little energy, let them clear out, let them be strong. And right here, the bottom of the ribs, kidney 22. So this is the front side of the diaphragm. We opened it up from the back. Let's open it from the front. Supple, supple. Good deep breaths. And lung one and two, the front of the shoulder, up in the corner of the chest, both sides. Master points for the lungs. And CV-17 right in the center of the chest, opening up this whole cardiopulmonary complex. And we've done front and back. Let's do a little reinforcement of the deep energy centers down here, below the navel. CV-6 and 4, conception vessel 6 and 4. Charge those batteries. This is where your deep, deep source of energy is in the body. We're going to shore that up and make sure it's charged. We're going to fill that lower dantian and store up energy. And one of my favorite points right here below the knee, 
stomached 36. Oh, such a broad spectrum point. Helps build stamina. The uh, Chinese name translates as leg three miles. So you go three more miles with this point. It helps you rebuild oh, in so many ways. And we're going to come down to liver three. So any stuck energy is going to be circulated with liver three. And we're going to add a little large intestine four that pairs with liver three, the four gates in the body. Everything circulates as it should, liver three, and kidney one. We bring it all down to the foundation. You're standing in your bubbling spring at kidney one. Stitching everything together, upper, middle, lower, into your own beautiful brocade. Thank you very much. Be well. Listen any time. Some is better than none, and consistency wins every time. Thank you. Linda Davis, InnerHarborAcupuncture.com.